what's new with you guys? How are things going? Good. How's the tour going? The tour's cool. Great. It's cool stuff. I see Where are we at? I, Hartford? I, I, We're in Hartford, Connecticut, right? You guys are in right? Hartford right now. And Let's I, all talk together. I see that uh, Chad is... Um, that Grammy nomination really went to his head because he's getting a really big head now. Yeah. Yeah, it's... Um, it's a day-to-day -day thing, though. Today, it's a little expanded. Sometimes... Um, doesn't even have a head. Really? Yeah. It's <laughs> kind of weird. Maybe you should give him head. I would give him head right now, but then, then, then it wouldn't go on TV. Cause they'd, well, yeah, can you yeah. guys blur that out? Blur it? Yeah. Can we do something? Cut to like a... Can, can we do something? Sure. Something? <laughs> sure. I got some questions uh, from your fans. Uh, the first one is from Amanda in Nova Scotia. Nova Scotia? Nova Scotia. In the Maritimes? Yes. Nova Scotia? I don't know what you're talking about. No, you're talking about? Uh, she is wondering if there are any plans to tour in Canada, especially Eastern Canada. Do you, do you always have a problem saying Canada? I will always want to say... Because I know somebody that I can help you with Canadia. that. I want to say Canada. Oh, you don't want to say that. They'll throw them all in No shit. That's why I'm trying not to... I mean, no crap. That's why I'm trying not to say Blowing it. Blowing it, Mike. Oh, Come man. on, buddy. Crying, they <laughs> go. Can't, can't do it. No, we um, we were going to come to Canada December thirteen to twenty, but that's not a really good idea, weather-wise, and um, we're gonna do it instead. I think February. In February. But don't, don't. I can't completely say that, but I know that the um, we need to get back there. It's been a long time. Canada rocks. We always. Every time I go to Canada, it's like, it's hysterical, literally. Especially like Saskatoon and um, Sydney, Sackville, like the small towns, like Hamilton, London. They're, um, the kids come out, it's just crazy. We play like little fire halls and stuff. It's always like really, really fun. Do you think they appreciate it more because they're not always being addressed by big bands coming through the area or because it's like a smaller, small town stuff? Or Yeah, well that, that applies to every city in the world, but... Um, the Canadians, especially because bands come in and they do Vancouver, they'll go over to the Victoria and they'll, you know, run hard to Alberta and do like maybe Edmonton, Calgary or in Canada, it's called Calgary. Calgary. Learn that. In Canada. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> you were not allowed. You, you know, they're going to remember this at the border. Uh, Mike. Yeah. You're not coming over. Yeah. Bud. I don't think so. Mike. Full so, cavity search for Mike. <laughs> yeah, they would do it too okay the next question here is from adam from boise idaho he said what was your guy's favorite song to work on for season of poison Oof. um crap i've never heard that question before. see what happens when this is what happens see what happens when when pe people who actually have knowledge about the band and want to ask a real question. It's a real question instead of like, so you released your first album three times. What, what do you think <laughs> what about you, that? <laughs> right. that's usually it's like, wonderful. It's great. First, first thing on Google. <laughs> it's, a, it's usually what the interviews are. Um, I don't. I mean, the, all of them were were fun to do. I. Uh, that's a that's a good question. <clears throat> Was there like different ways that some were fun? Like anything in particular that kind of as you guys were recording it, something you added that was like really brought the song together was, you know, any moments like that, or did you guys kind of have an idea of what you were going in to do? Kind of. Well, we had a, we had a, um, a vague directional idea. Like, mm -hmm. you know, let's try to like, I mean, I'm talking like wide and vague. Mm -hmm. The way we did it was sort of like, um, you know, the movie fight club. Of course, yeah. You know, remember when Brad put let go of the wheel and the car just kind of went wherever it wanted to? You haven't no. seen the movie and I'm um, over it. I saw it. I saw a little bit of it the other day, but I read all You're Chuck's books. But no, it was, on, it was on Spike. I'm not lying. It's on Spike TV. I'm not going to lie to you, man. I'm going to be real. Because you could have just totally bullshitted me because I don't remember that you part. Can't you could have been like, TV. you remember? This guy's just... No. <laughs> You'd be like, yeah, remember that part? And I'd be like, yes, of course I do. And you'd be like, that wasn't in the movie. Interview over. <laughs> <laughs> no, we, 
Um, with 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 the new album, we just kind of let it go where it wanted to. Mm-hmm. Cause you um you can't really sit down and go oh, we're gonna okay we're gonna make a rap record right it must be rap a start now it was just it just kind of became what it was all by itself organically it's its own little it's its own little creature little furry creature did you go with the same producers and stuff this time around or did you yeah we did we um we got them for a hell of a deal no we we produce everything we produce the first album and the second album we got um Andy Wallace to mix the record which is oh, really that's cool. cool. He's done. Nirvana. Oh yeah, everybody. Sonic Youth, Rage, yeah, yeah. <coughs> um, the Flintstones. He he mixed that. I'm gonna take your word for it because I don't want to yeah. get caught in a trap. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next question is from. Oh man, this one's from Michelle. She's in Lubbock, Texas. What's wrong? And she says. Well, what's so funny about I'm from Plainview, Texas. I'm, I'm not hate, joke I am not messing on? with Texas right now. I swear to God. I just the question to me was interesting. When you are getting ready for a gig, do you sing to your own music in the shower? If not, who do you listen to while dancing around getting ready for a gig? Um, Solid question, by the way. Two parter though. You know the, the, the you, this, this girl's gonna cry when she sees this, and everyone in the background's laughing. <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> we'll edit it out. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Chad sings Peter Gabriel songs over and over again while he dances in the shower. Oh, so he does both. He dances in the shower. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Seven. Yeah. Um, gosh, what? Uh, yeah, I'll make that the final answer. It's the That's I mean, answer. If they're looking for like an artist name, I would just say it, he warns her to Peter Gabriel. Sicily sings um, Sundays songs. Remember that band, The Sundays? No. Fight Club? They were in Fight Club? Yeah. What, what part? The part. That one part. Well, do you guys have any uh, pre-show rituals that you guys do or anything? It's any superstition and adult. Okay, fair enough. But it, you know, keeps the blood flowing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we well, we have this thing called prep time, which is an hour and a half for two hours before the show, where we you know get together and um, and just do weird, you know, weird stuff. Kind of team stuff, like. Sometimes it's uh sometimes uh we use hand. Sometimes we um now we have this thing where we warm up, sing, have a drink, have a meal, talk, get ready for the show, spit on each other, slap each other, literally. Just you know, just like stupid football stuff. That's cool. That's cool. A uh let's see. Eli from Sacramento. I was wondering what were some of your favorite bands when you were a teen? Oh, so we're not teens? We're like 80? Hey, take it up with Ooh, Eli. Yeah, younger. <laughs> Before you got old and stupid. Get the beer out of here. They're underage. <laughs> um, we listened to all kinds of music. Like, uh, I mean, it was the, we were teens. What year was that? Like 2006? What were some good bands back then, man? <laughs> this guy pulls him out of his ass. I don't know what he comes up with. It. One after another with this guy. No, we're big. We're big um, Pink Floyd fans. We like um, anything that's really melodic and song bassy and vocally. Mm-hmm. It's um, that's what we're into. And next we have Milton wants to know. Milton. Wants Milton to know. from. Kenosha, Wisconsin. Kenosha. He's a he wants, cheesehead. He wants to know if you oh, could... Now he's <laughs> Russian? <laughs> I was trying to do kind of like a... I don't know what I'm doing. That's definitely not a Wisconsin accent. Okay. He wants can to you, know what you're doing. Can <laughs> Where are your papers? Okay. Where are the papers? What would be a Wisconsin accent? You Wisconsin, been Wisconsin. Ben, help me out here. Wisconsin. <laughs> he's not Russian. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't know. 